Hello, Beret Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beret Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. It is Saturday. It is the weekend, and we are just here having fun. It's going to be a chill weekend. Nice girl. Let me know what you guys are doing this weekend because you know what? Do whatever you want to do. I'm going to be, you know, I'm going to be chilling out there. I have a couple meetings, reunions, but not reunions, like, like, um, how you say like meetings with friends? Is that a thing in English? I don't know how to say it in English. But anyways, Latino woman, you know what I mean. So, um, but it's not like a party party, you know, it's just kind of like um, a birthday situation, a brunch here, you know, like little things. I don't know how to say that in English. It's not a date because it's with like multiple people. But anyways, girl, I hope that you're having a beautiful and amazing weekend, that you are having fun, that you are relaxing before another week. And girl... It is time to talk about being messy. Messy like my hair. My hair is a mess right now. I don't know what to do. I'm everywhere. Anyways, girl, yesterday, like, the internet was broke. Like, girl, this news, honestly, I was like, I have been expecting this for so long that I was so damn excited, okay? Okay. Yesterday, it's official, 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 the return of Miss Stacy Schroeder to our TVs. Yes, yes, yes. Fuck it. I love Stacy. I think Vanderpump Rules went down, start going down when Stacy went out. Like, she is reality TV. She was made for reality TV. And, like, we just need it back. And I'm so sorry, but if we are getting Kristen Doty back in the, uh, in the valley, being, like, as messy as she has always been, girl, we can also get Stacy Shorter back, okay? I am so excited because... She she has gone through, like, a lot, you know? She made a mistake, and we rust her for that mistake, you know? I mean, I think that she, she lost everything because of that mistake. And to me, the way that I think about life, right, is that, you know, everyone makes mistakes, but it's what you make with those mistakes what really show what kind of person you are going to be, right? And I believe that if you really do your job, you um, educate yourself, you uh, become a better person, right? That's the whole idea of making a mistake, you know? That you become something better, that you never do it again. But also, I feel that if no one is going to give you the chance to show that you change, how is that? How how are we gonna like work in this world? You know, that's why I don't I don't really like cancel culture that much. You know, because to me, it's like yes, let's call people out when they do bullshit. You know, when they do think nasty things, they need to be called out, especially if they are in a public platform. But just like we call them out, we need to give them the chance to see if they're going to evolve, to see if they're going to educate themselves, to see if they're going to change. If they don't, fuck it. Get out of, you know, you don't deserve this platform. Get out of here. But if they come back and they show us that they change, that they are different, that they don't, that whatever they were canceled for, they they learn, you know, and, and, and it's different, then we need to be giving a second a chance to people, you know. It's just the way it is. Now, uh, with Stasi, you know, yes, she did this horrible mistake and she was canceled for it and she lost everything. But I am very excited to see because I know, like, I have heard her podcast. I have seen her go through all of this and I have always said, like, you know, how are we gonna, how, how is she gonna ever show the world that she changed if no one is really giving her a chance? Well, enter Miss Queen Absolutely Amazingness, Lisa Vanderpump. Because if there is anyone in this world who knows that the shit in this world is not black and white, that we are in a, in a, in a sea of grace and that we need to be open to give people second chances is Miss Lisa Vanderpump, you know? And I love, love, love this. And yesterday it was official announced that Miss Stasi will be returning as a cast member of season two of Vanderpump Villa in Hulu. 
and I am so over the moon over this. I'm bet I bet that she's going to be probably even like a, an event coordinator, or she's going to be like a manager, or she's going to be like something like that. And I'm very very excited to see her because she has grown so much. She's a mother. She has two kids. She's married. So we're gonna be seeing her on a whole different state than what we last time we saw her back in like uh 2019 2020 you know what i mean um she posted well both of them you know posted like lisa posted and then uh, stassi as well a picture of both of them and stassi said you know i'm walking around these halls pretending to be european royalty hashtag vanderpum villa but not only that not only she is returning to you know reality tv she's also signed a doku comedy series okay with hulu as well so we're gonna be seeing her doing something else she it says stassi schroeder is ready to set her own rules with stassi says the vanderpump rules alum is making her reality tv return with a new half hour docu comedy series in the work at hulu stassi says was created by Stacy Schroeder and former Vanderpump Rules producer Erin Foy and Jenna Rosenthal and will be executive produced by Scout Productions along with Foy, Rosen Rosenfeld and Schroeder. Endlessly relate relatable, utterly hysterical and questionably sane, Stacy is the anchor of a fresh ensemble of comedy and chaotic characters who are dealing with identity crisis and major life crossroads of their own. And Stasi is the one who has to keep them all afloat, reads the official long line of the series. Girl, I'm here for it. Okay, I don't know what we're going to get. I mean, I'm talking because of my own excitement, but I have no idea how, what we're going to get. And this is the part that I'm just hoping that this, like, Stasi has been giving that second chance. Okay, it took almost five years, probably five years, because this is happening on 2025. So it's, it took five years for this second chance to come back. I'm hoping that she is going to show us that she deserved this second chance. I'm going to support her as long as I see that she is a new person. You know, again, I have I, I listen to her podcast. I I watch the things that she's done on, on social media, you know. And I, in my opinion, she has changed. She is a different person. But I now I'm gonna wait and see how that is gonna translate on the TV, you know. That is really gonna showing us the new and improved Stacy Schroeder. So I'm here for it. I'm very excited. I love Vanderpump Villa season one. If you haven't watched it, go and watch it. It's really good. So I'm, I'm curious to see how Stas is going to fit on season two. And then this new docuseries, I think she's also going to be doing very, very fabulous funny things and I'm here for it. So congratulations to Stasi. Let me know what you guys think on the comments below. And if you want to get all the tea of Bravo or reality TV or whatever, you know, Subscribe, 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 like, share, comment, do the whole thing. I love you guys, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.